This is the story of God for the people of God. When the day of Pentecost had come, they were all together in one place. And suddenly from heaven there came a sound like the rush of a violent wind and it filled the entire house where they were sitting. Divided tongues as of fire appeared among them, and a tongue rested on each of them. All of them were filled with the Holy Spirit and began to speak in other languages, as the Spirit gave them the ability. Comme l'Esprit leur a donné la capacité. Y había judíos que moraban en Jerusalén, hombres piadosos, procedentes de todas las naciones bajo el cielo. Y al ocurrir este estruendo, La multitud se juntó y estaban desconcertados porque cada uno les oía hablar en su propia lengua y estaban asombrados y se maravillaban diciendo Now there were devout Jews from every nation under heaven living in Jerusalem and at this sound the crowd gathered and was bewildered because each one heard them speaking in the native language of each Amazed and astonished, they asked, Ces gens-là qui parlent, ne sont-ils pas tous Galiléens? Comment donc les entendons-nous chacun dans la propre langue du pays où nous sommes nés? Perth, Med, Elamite et ceux qui habitent la Mésopotamie, la Judée, la Cappadoce, le Pont et l'Asie. Are not all these that are speaking Galileans? And how is it that we hear each of us in our own native tongues? Parthians. Medes, Elamites, and residents of Mesopotamia, Judea and Cappadocia, Pontus and Asia. Phrygia, Pamphylia, Mizraim, Libya, Phat, Ephacarene, Neahohua, Wufi, Roma, Yudafua, Guadang, Yudafu, Yatisa, Wadi, Yankasako, Yankoponghu, Adekesi. Phrygia and Pamphylia, Egypt and the parts of Libya belonging to Cyrene, and visitors from Rome, both Jews and proselytes, Cretans and Arabs, in our own languages, we hear them speak about God's deeds of power. All were amazed and perplexed, saying to one another, what does this mean? Que significa esto? Que veut dire ceci? E asem peni. Que quiere decir esto? E otiden irinya hamya. Was soll das bedeuten? But others sneered and said, they are filled with new wine. Ils sont pleins de vin doux. Ay, están borrachos. Kudri se sure chia ta hadra. Si son ubriacati di mosto. In sa donko donko abongo. Si son von süßen wein betrunken. Pedro ga yoran sa dua hamke soso sori del nupio irude. Yude indelwa yerusalem e sanem moden samdra. I iril noiro algi al kosini ne mare kiril kiurira. But Peter, standing with the eleven, raised his voice and addressed them. People of Judea and all who live in Jerusalem, let this be known to you, and listen to what I say. Indeed, these are not drunk, as you suppose, for it is only nine o'clock in the morning. No, this is what was spoken through the prophet Joel. In den letzten Tagen wird es geschehen, so spricht Gott. Ich werde von meinem Geist ausgießen über alles Fleisch. In the last days it will be, God declares, that I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh. Eure Söhne und Töchter werden Propheten sein. Eure jungen Männer werden Visionen haben und eure Alten werden Träume träumen. And your sons and your daughters shall prophesy, and your young men shall see visions, and your old men shall dream dreams. In quei giorni spanderò del mio spirito sopra i miei servi e sopra le mie serve, e profetizzeranno. Even upon my servants, both men and women, in those days I will pour out my spirit, and they shall prophesy. 
and I will show portents in the heaven above. I farò prodigi su nel cielo e segni giù sulla terra, sangue, fuoco e vapore di fumo. And signs on the earth below, blood and fire and smoky mist. Il sera changé en ténèbres et la lune en sang avant que la grande et éclatante journée du Seigneur vienne. The sun shall be turned to darkness and the moon to blood before the coming of the Lord's great and glorious day. Then everyone who calls on the name of the Lord shall be saved. Everyone. Everyone. Tous. Obiara. Todos. Tutti. Everyone. Yeda. Nubudendi. Everyone. Everyone. Everyone.